What is up, everybody? Hungry Cabigon here. It's been a little while since we've opened some Pokemon stuff. I feel like we've been opening a lot of random stuff recently. I got 15 Mystery Packs for you today. These ones are only 200 yen each, uh, which is very cheap, obviously. But we've had some good luck with these in the past. And potentially there's some pretty good stuff we can get out of here. So I, I hope we get one or two nice ones. So anyway, let's see what we got. Don't know which way is the way to open this. Okay, so we got Hollow. And we get Espartha EX Terrestrialize. So that's probably like a baseline, I would say. Is is just an EX and a Hollow. But it's still, it's 200 yen. It's basically slightly more expensive than the price of a pack. So I guess that's, it's decent realistically all right there's our hollow oh all right well that's a bit more exciting skelly dirge ssr we take that we do have a bunch of these but that's that's not bad a little shiny boy there all right let's keep that kind of uh baseline going For, especially these cost 200 yen it's very cheap okay Ooh, little Caps Kid. Take that, he's called Kapusaiji. Shiny little boy, I like it. It's actually interesting, Shiny Treasure EX. Um, you can buy boxes uh, for 4,500 yen at the moment at a shop near my house. The, the retail price is 5,500, so they're actually 1,000 yen off. And you can buy up to 20 boxes, they're saying. And uh, the other new sets as well, you can buy up to a case now. So it's, the ecosystem is returning to normal. It's nice to see. All right, Orthworm and Graphite Eye. Shiny boy, I don't know if we have that, maybe. I feel like I have seen it before, but I don't recall. Hmm, I'm not sure, but this is this is nice for 200 yen. If we're getting shinies and stuff, I'm definitely take that. All right, what do we got? Ooh, art rare Metagross. That's kind of a nice one. I like that artwork. Just making snowballs. I don't know what they're doing, clearing the snow, I guess. But interesting. All right, let's keep that kind of thing going. All right, Copper Raja, Hollow, and we got a Pyro Art Rare. So some of some of these Art Rares are definitely not worth 200 yen, but I'm so much happier to get that. Like, we just got the one with the Aspartha, and then all the other ones have something, like, much more exciting in there. So that is, is even if they're, like, not worth much, I would be so much happier with that than a, than an EX or a, a V or whatever. So that that is really nice. Toxtricity always makes an appearance. And Crydon EX. Yeah. See, that's a little bit more boring. I'm I'm surprised actually though the amount of semi-decent stuff they're giving us in here. That's pretty nice. Let's uh, press on. Let's see what we can get in this one. Miraidon. And Fortress. Oh no. We're going back the other way now. Getting the boring stuff again. Still, only three so far have just had EXs, so we take that hit rate. And how many have we got left? Oh, we still got a reasonable amount left. No top prizes coming out yet, although that does look like a textured card. It was around the other way. All right. We got Leon and. Oh, I'll take that. A nice. Uh, V-Star Universe SAR. Nice. All right, well, that's pretty good. I mean, that was definitely worth a little bit at some point. I think that the market for a lot of these cards has really tanked recently. So it's probably like a thousand yen, you know, that's that's still pretty good. Nice full art trainer. Got a little ice cube there, chilling. All right, so we take that one. That's good. Is this one backwards as well? All right, we got Claude Sire and... Oh, no. Yeah. 
This one we got two EXs. That's interesting. Maybe because they were just not very exciting EXs. They gave us two. I don't know. I feel like this is still quite generous, honestly, for 200 yen. I didn't expect to get so many baby shinies and art rares and stuff like that. So that is nice. And we press on. All right. Gee, oh no. We had a nice one and now we're, we're going back. We're going back down the, the wrong path. Oh, we still got a few more to go. Okay, Gobrios. And, okay, that's actually not a bad one to get. The Iron Leaves. We'll take that. That's a, that's actually, like, worth a couple of bucks, that EX, as opposed to the rest of them. So that's not a bad one to get. All right, next. Wigglytuff. I've seen too many Wigglytuffs recently. And a live Wu Chen reaction. No. Ah, uh, we were having a good run, and it's kind of all going downhill. Wait, which way? This way? Or Beetle. Random. Haven't seen him for a while. And... Oh, all right. We got a Rapid Strike Urshifu, which actually was a very good card and desirable card at one point. How small is this sleeve? What can fit in that? Yu-Gi-Oh card, maybe. All right. Lucky last. Let's go. Come on. Heatran. And, oh, Mankey. I'm pretty sure I don't have Mankey. Little green monkey. So, I mean, honestly, that's pretty good. Like, we got, we definitely got, like, a box worth of stuff. Um, I mean, honestly, I, I didn't expect much out of 200 yen packs. So, what's that, 7 out of 15 of them had something more exciting than an EX. That's honestly pretty good. Uh, I think I'm going to try and get some more of these. I feel like that's it's pretty reasonable value. And we got, as usual, some Vs and EXs, etc. Nice little stack. So, yeah. I mean, honestly, we can't really complain. One shiny EX, three baby shinies, full art trainer, two art rares. I mean, if we bought a box of shiny treasure, we would basically get that if we were lucky we would get the trainer and i mean honestly the cards in that set are pretty cheap so um, i mean four of the cards we got are actually from that set i'm pretty happy with that for the price i think we'll try some more cheap ones see how we go let me know what you think anyway guys check out the channel for more videos please leave a like comment and subscribe and we'll see you in the next one take it easy